Good afternoon. Welcome, guys. Welcome to my channel. My name is Amina, and this is Eastside High Priestess. Today, we're going to be doing Scorpio's reading. Scorpio's. Scorpio, Scorpio. We're also going to be doing guided messages. Um, a message from your lover. From the love oracle. Um, message from your angels and ancestors. And also a message from the queen of the moon. Oracle. Okay. Let's get started. Angels behind spirit guides. What is the message for Scorpio at this time? All my messages are timeless, by the way. So when you see this, when you're meant to see it, if it doesn't resonate, don't try to make it fit for you, okay? There's other tarot readers. Okay. What's the message for Scorpio? Message for Scorpio, please. Ooh, this flew out there. Okay, so we have temperance, patience, bringing balance into the situation. Mm. Okay, so we had a seven of swords. Somebody. Somebody trying to be strategic, plan how to bring balance to the situation. That's what I'm getting here. We got, yeah. <laughs> we got the um, Ace of Swords, but it's in reverse. So, you know. When the Ace of Swords, it's to me, when it's in reverse, it's like, maybe I, he, they want to come through with some conversation, but we're probably going to end up arguing type shit. Okay, so they was in the obviously they was in the Nine of Swords. Mhm, mm but it was in reverse. They wasn't at um obviously in that. Maybe they maybe they have come to a realization. going to clarify with mystical tarot this message. Let's clarify these these messages at this time, please. What is the message for Scorpio? For my Scorpios. Message for my Scorpios, please. What is this? Oh, Lord. Listen. We're not taking all these. We're not taking all these. Ooh. That is sun at the bottom. <laughs> okay. So maybe they see you as their happiness. What's the message? One more time. One more time. Okay. Ooh, Lord. One more. Okay, it's out there. <laughs> what I tell you. They see you as they have missed. Okay. There's devil energy. Okay. Guys. Yeah, they see you as their happiness. Or maybe they don't, maybe they don't have nowhere to go. They in a, they in a situation. And they trying to get out of it. We also have the um, Queen of Cups here. Clarify her intemperance. 
So we have um, could be you could be messing with a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. Also, you know, Leo, Sag, Aries, and um, definitely Leo is out here. <laughs> Also, um, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. One second, please. So I'm gonna clarify what my uh Fendel Sicle Kipper deck. Look at my crystals. Ah. Okay. Alright. Guys, that's what I'm getting here. I'm definitely getting somebody, you know, trying to be strategic. Maybe they're going through a situation. Maybe they didn't put you in a, a messed up situation. And they're trying to get back. Or maybe you did that. And you're trying to get back. Go back to that person. Trying to bring balance. Thinking about how to bring balance back into the situation. Because you see the major happiness. Because you was toxic. You brought toxic or they brought toxic energy into the situation. Right, guys, please clarify this message. What is this message right here? Yes, pathway. So it could be, I'm thinking that it, it, it could be. past life or like a soulmate. Yeah, they see you in high regard. Cool. Maybe, okay, y'all could be a, listen, y'all could have children together. They see you working hard. See you taking care of your business, and you got money. They see you. They see you making moves. They see you making moves. Listen. Could be going through some court situation. Okay, Scorpios. Let's get a guided message from your ancestors. A message for Scorpio, please, at this time. A message for Scorpio, please. Where's my message for Scorpio at this time? message from my Scorpios. So, also this, I should have said this in the beginning, but this could resonate if it's in your sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Okay? So, or you could be messing with a Capricorn, too. Just saying that. Or maybe you have Capricorn in their chart. Okay, what is the message for Scorpios at this time? Ooh. Listen. Message for Scorpio, please. Listen, I'm taking all the ones that slide now. Okay, y'all? Alright. So, I'm going to need to harness your, you know, harness your powers within. Trust in your instincts. Hold the space. Be patient. Be firm. 
Mm-hmm. Be firm and graceful within your actions. And connect within yourself. Connect with your emotions. Listen to your intuition. Your your spirit guides are probably trying to contact you. Like be in contact with you if you, if any of you have seen any recurring numbers, um, you know, angel numbers. Two 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 four 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 four. And I said four four four. <laughs> two 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 four 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 five 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 one one one, you know. Eleven eleven. So what is this message from your lover, your love interest for Scorpio at this time? Messages. What is the messages for Scorpio at this time? How do this significant other feel about them? How does their love interest feel about them? What is what do they need to know? For my Scorpio. One more time. What is the message from my Scorpio at this time, please? Okay. Oh shit. Hey y'all, that smacked me in the face. <laughs> okay, the bottom of the deck trust. Transformation occurs through acceptance. Once you accept the current situation, it will automatically transform. Okay? So let's see what these other messages say. Um, healing. Imagine yourself and your beloved surrounded by light. Feel your relationship being healed in this very moment. Beware of what you are projecting. For the qualities you admire in one another are qualities you both possess. Equally, so the qualities you don't like are also the reflection of your own self, which is true because we literally get what we attract, we put out the energy that we put out, we get, we get that for ourselves. You know, that's why I tell people like, you cannot be mad. Like, when you're in a relationship and the relationship's not going back, take that, take at that time, you have to take that time to reflect within yourself because that's what you're. That's what you're manifesting for yourself. Your thoughts are everything. Really. People really don't know the power of your mind. Seriously. But once you love, completely have love for yourself, love whole, like, genuinely loving yourself, not having to feel like you need to prove yourself to anybody or Anything like that. You know what I mean? Being comfortable. Knowing that you are deserving of everything that you want. Once you have that. That knowledge within yourself. And that acceptance within yourself. Then you'll start to see better things coming your direction. Okay. So we also have embrace. Through each other you find the missing pieces. Oh. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Let there be closeness between you, but always give each other space. Love never claims, it simply allows and gives. That's beautiful. Okay. So, last but not least, Queen of the Moon. Scorpio, I like y'all message today. We even got a message for Scorpios at this time. That a message for Scorpios, please, at this time. Yeah, get ready for work. <laughs> Got a messages. Mm. We have faith. Somebody could be pregnant. Just saying. Okay. Faith. Ooh, in abundance. Mm -hmm. 
Take note of any animals that you see too. Crossing your path. <laughs> Somebody could be. Oh, two came out. Oh my goodness, I got only one. Okay, so we have yeah resistance. Let me show you these cards. So some of you could be. Some of you could be resisting. It's time to take that leap of faith into the divine. Divine knowledge. You could be resisting in this situation. Somebody is pregnant. I'm just getting at it. Somebody is with child. Yeah, she's, you know. Guys, the time is now, okay? Know that you are one within the universe. And then when you resist, all you do is hold yourself back from the highest version of yourself. Alright guys, time for me to go get ready for work. Have a blessed day.